you say an original fertilizer? Yeah, that's an original fertilizer. Well, how, how, what is it made out of? Iron. And, and iron. Then this and the uh, zinc and zinc. here copper. Ah, uh, okay. okay. And, and the so. wire was connected here. Yeah. Where you uh, have. Uh, have uh, and, and, and what did it do? It, it was fertilizer. How did it. Now, the, this was digged in the soil and it was connected with wires in the soil. Right. Uh, on the wall fields. Huh? Wow. Okay. Like uh, so with like wires a... north from south to north. So this looks magnetic too. Is it? Is it? Um, yes, it becomes this... magnetic mm. Mm. naturally. Yeah. yeah. It's got something underneath there as well. Is that a wire? Yes, it's like to collect the kind of energy. Yeah. Wow, that's terrific. It is awesome. That's cool. So it's like a battery that they buried. Mm, so, yes, in a certain way. Hmm. Uh, he explains how it works in the patent. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Gosh. How cool. Yeah. Did you buy that in France? No, that's the only original surviving piece in the world, I think, really? for the moment, yes. that we know of. <laughs> are, you go, are you going to make some? Are you going to make some? No, because it's not interesting today. No, now I do this yes. one. Sorry. Yes. To replace this one, I invented this one. And so you put um, this little magnetic antenna yeah. connected to a wire yes. as from, from south to north. And this replace this one. Wow. It's more easy and uh, yeah. uh, it's, more, it's more practical. Yeah. So where would you put that? I mean, you, you don't bury that. Then, then, yes, then you bury wires every one meter and a half right. north-south in parallel in the wall field. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, well. But for yeah. grassland, it's not really interesting. But for uh, crops, yeah. it's yeah. interesting. Yeah. Tell me, what's this here? And, and this is just basalt yes. that I put in a, in a, in a tube. Yes. And this will uh, do a magnetic, a natural magnetic treatment of the water. And this will energize the water really very strongly and oh, very is that right? naturally. So what do you got in there? Crystals? Yes, and basalt. Yeah. Oh, I see. Okay. See. So those are just clear little shaped um, quartz crystals. Yes, that I do yeah. also treatment on it to, to improve, but yes. But the main effect is the basalt. Right. Yeah. And it's like a magnetic treatment. But a natural magnetic treatment. So if we, it, it, so we should have that coming into our houses, yeah. Ah oh, yes, it can help. And also, if you give water to the cows or water plants, yeah. to the plants, uh, it's good. To, and it's very cheap to make. You see. Yeah. Uh, have you got yeah. any? Do you sell any of these? Yes. Yes. Okay. That's my first prototype. I. That's my first prototype a few years ago. Yes. And. Uh, but there I put also magnets, but now I put those magnets away because this is already, yeah. have already enough effect. And you just... But, and you can, I can make this uh, bigger too, uh, for, yeah. uh, for yeah. farmers. Mm. Uh, yeah. yeah, I certainly... If, really you, cool. if you've got any... Um, yeah. I'll, oh, but yeah. for the moment I, I have to make them now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. But... Uh, yeah. Uh, the, the, this is... Very interesting book, The Geomagnetic Effect on Terrestrial Life. And there you have uh, a lot of scientific studies on the effects of uh, magnetism and electrical field on plant growth, on animals, on... Everything. So this is well known. That's, this is really... This yeah. shows that there is a lot of science behind that too. That yeah. it's not only... Yes. Uh, so, <laughs> so what was the Dutch book that was written that you talked about in your video uh, uh, about explaining something? It was um, that we saw, uh, you said a Dutch guy had... Oh, uh, there are so much books, I yeah. don't know which book yeah. you are talking about. Okay. But that uh, one is a good one to read, yeah? That, that's for the people that want to know the signs. Yeah. Uh -huh. Right. But uh, for the practical aspects I'm making, is you have my books. Yes. And I'm making also new books now for each technique. Good. I'm making books. So I'll, um, have we, will you have those out in English? And here, 
Uh, the, this one in, in one month it will come out okay. in English. Oh, uh, really? this, this only about basalt. Uh, yes. Yeah. yeah. The, the, this is, for example, a book wow. about uh, scientific um, uh, developments from 1927. And there they speak also about electroculture. You have a whole ch 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 chapter about electroculture in that book. Wow. Uh, uh, here, that's about electroculture. Huh. How did you find that book? Yes, I, I'm, I'm, I'm always searching. Eh? Yeah. So, <laughs> so it's wow. 20 pages about electroculture. Wow. And then you have this one too. It's a similar book, also 1927. That's wow. a German book. Uh, yeah. And uh, it's also how they make electricity from the air, oh. uh, for example. And wow. then also about electroculture with antennas, doors oh, like wow. this. Wow. And with results, here you see field grown with electroculture without. Wow. I see a huge difference. <coughs> here you see without.